All right, today we're going to talk about Gill's mealybug and pistachios. This is a very important insect of pistachios. Gill's mealybug overwinters as first instars underneath the uh, uh, the bark of the tree in the trunk or in crevices within uh, within the tree. Uh, this this uh, pest has three generations per season. So the the, the mealybug that's overwintering is from the last uh, generation in in the fall of uh, 2020. What you want to be doing this early in the season, right, right uh, before bud break, is you want to start tracking the population. All the mealybug will be embedded in the, in the trunk, under the bark, but as the temperature starts to rise up and as the tree starts to send sugars to the growing point, the mealybug will know that. So the majority of the population is going to start to come out and they're going to start colonizing the, uh, the buds of, uh, of the limbs. This is, they're going to move in here to try to, to begin feeding. Uh, as the temperatures warm up, Again, they're going to become more abundant, but what you want to do is you want to start looking in two places. For one thing, you want to start looking, you want to start peeling some bark on the trunk of the tree. Always look for a history of, uh, of mealy bug infestation and you start peeling some of the bark from the tree and look underneath to see what the mealy bug population is doing. Here, what you want to see is look both on the tree itself and on the bark, and here you'll be able to find uh, a lot of mealy bug. All these our first instar uh, gills mealybug overwintering uh, very susceptible to a centaur application this time of year but this is what, what you're looking at in uh, the bark of the tree on the trunk if you look over here we also found a healthy population of gills mealybug right here all of these as temperatures start to warm up they'll move over to the butt here, here's a butt that is infested with gills mealybug and uh, here we got a couple of mealybugs on the move Again, right now it's warming up. Uh, they're waking up. They're moving to the buds to feed. Here we have a, a, the terminal bud with heavily infested with uh, about 15 to 20 mealybugs. Uh, they're settled and they're uh, starting to feed. So uh, early March, it is uh, time for the mealybug to wake up, uh, possibly for a, a centaur application.